In Josephine County, we have a resident who has had some very good experiences with dogs, so much so that he's written a book about it. After living with as many as 19 dogs, Paul Handover moved to Southern Oregon and wrote a book called Learning from Dogs. The book shares his experiences with a German shepherd named Pharaoh. Paul found that writing a book was a huge undertaking, but with encouragement from a local writing group, he finished the book and put it on the market. I asked Paul what inspired him to write this book. I had cause to be speaking to a good friend who uh, by background was a professional psychotherapist and uh, he mentioned that dogs are creatures of integrity and this was when I had Pharaoh, my German Shepherd, that's him on the cover of the book who is still with us but now a very old dog and I thought yes they are creatures of integrity and that struck me as such an important principle. Paul's fondness for dogs is obvious but it goes beyond just his own personal impressions. Handover asserts that dogs have qualities that we could all learn from, not only for our own personal lives, but for the sake of our country and for the world. Creatures of integrity. And of course they are. And when one looks around at the world today, unfortunately we see too many signs of us dear humans exhibiting poor integrity and that's what got me really thinking and then over a couple of years I started drafting out all the qualities of dogs that I think we humans should take real notice of uh, for the sake of, of for the sake of our future and a couple of years ago I started thinking about those qualities uh, openness trust faithfulness, loyalty, playfulness, and more. That the qualities that we as humans really do need to learn and to have in our lives on a daily basis because they deliver such beautiful rewards. So, learn from dogs and save the world. That's the message. Learn more by visiting the website learningfromdogs.com. Reporting from Josephine County for Channel 15 News, I'm John Letts, and back to you, Alex.